Hello everyone, welcome to Creative by Nature. My name is Donna. Today I have a really fun Dollarama haul to share with you all. Let's get into it. So Dollarama. Dollarama is a Canadian dollar store. Everything ranges from, I've seen things for like around 80 cents all the way up to four dollars. Purchased more of these containers for my craft room. They were four dollars each. I got two. I'm hoping that I can fit some uh, eight by eight, eight and a half by eleven paper sheets in here. This is nothing new at Dollarama, but I have been holding off on buying it. It's the plastic drawer organizer, and it has these little mini containers that you can pull out like a drawer and they have a little latch it was four dollars for this set great deal there's been lots of people hauling these it's um uh, one of my daughter's birthdays coming up and we're putting uh, some goodie bags together so i purchased a package of these mini mechanical pencils they just had such pretty colors it's just a regular lead it's not colored i was hoping it was colored but it's not but still they're fun to use comes with 18 and four dollars each there have been a few of my youtube friends here in canada hauling these misters it's the ultra fine misters i have a few already that i purchased at another store so they weren't exactly like these but pretty much it's very similar but I wanted to try these ones out and they were two dollars for three so I finally broke down and bought these brush pens and from Ann makes she uh, does a lot of different art and whatnot she works for different companies she says these actually work great uh, for playing around and practicing so I thought I'm gonna give these a try I got one of each package so I thought these would be great to use in my art journals or if I'm practicing my sketching and whatnot and want to color something and they were two dollars a package so since I've been getting into painting more I wanted to stock up on my paint brushes because I had to throw some out I'm not somebody who takes care of my paint brushes Anyways, I got a package of, they're called professional paint brushes, uh, but uh, these actually are pretty good. Um, I've had these in the round before and I really liked them. They didn't have any round left, which is actually what I really wanted, but I wanted to give these ones a try. $3 for the package. And then I've had these before. I absolutely love them. Again, three dollars a package and these ones are both synthetics now I found these they're round but these ones have got camel hair oh, I thought that was so cool usually paintbrushes with some animal hair are a lot more expensive so when I saw that I thought "Ooh, I have to try them I thought this would be great to use with watercolor paints I was so excited when I saw this they are the shrink sheets $1.50 for two sheets. I grabbed six because you know how it goes. They get cool stuff like this in and then once it's gone, it's gone. I got this because I thought it would be really cool to try using stays on ink and stamp images on here and then color it in with a sharpie. Uh, like a colored sharpie or something anyways I thought this would be so fun to play around with and come up with some different um, embellishments I thought this was really cool so this is like nautical rope but they had different colors they had white and then they had this neutral they had orange and this green and there's 9.9 .9 yards for two dollars I thought that was great and I love that you could get these different colors so I got the four packages two of each of these colors just to try out okay so this is always a hot commodity if you can find them the 
bottle lights. I got three packages, one for myself, one, for, sorry, one for myself, one for a friend, and I'm going to be having a giveaway in the future, and I'm starting to put some things together, and this will be included in a price package. So I had seen this before a while back and I had left it, but then I saw my friend Dawn from Cela V. She had purchased this and I'm like, oh shoot, why did I not get it? It is such a fun thing to have. It is the scratch and sniff sticker pad. So when I was out, I looked and they had it in stock again, so I had to grab one. But it is all fairies and woodland and you get all these different scenes and then all these different stickers and they're all scratch and sniff. So you can create your own scenes. So I thought this might be fun to do with my kids. Okay, I should say my one daughter. My oldest wouldn't be into it. I don't think my son would be into this flowery stuff, but I just thought it would be something fun to do. And you can totally use these stickers on different projects. But this was $4, I believe. Yeah, this was $4. An excellent deal for over 210 stickers. So I had to get that. Uh, just so you know, any channels that I mention in my video, I will link everybody's channel in the description box so you can go and check them out because there's a lot of people who do different hauls and different creative projects so and they're most of them are Canadian there might be a few US but uh, this is a Dollarama haul so a lot of the names I mentioned will be Canadian YouTubers okay so now I am going to be moving on to the ho um, home decor stuff and I'm also going to be showing you just a few items that aren't craft related and the reason why is because um, I wanted to just give you a little bit of a product review uh, so if you see these in your Dollarama store just so you know it is a great item so uh, first off this for home decor is this macrame plant hanger uh, I wanted to use this in my daughter's room she's trying to go with a boho natural look for her room and yeah, you can make these, but I saw this and I thought, you know what, let's just give this a try and see how that works. And if uh, she likes it, then for $3, perfect. Mom doesn't have to make it. So I got three packages of pillowcases. I am slowly uh, changing things in my master bedroom, just kind of redecorating and I wanted to just get some pillowcases for de decoration on the bed. So they have this gray, this cream, and this mustard yellow with uh, the print on it in kind of like an off-white. They were only $2.50 each and you get two pillowcases, 50% cotton and 50% polyester. So I thought that wasn't bad for... 250 so I thought I'm gonna give those a try so I had purchased these hand towels a while back and I tried them out and I love them I am actually gonna be replacing a whole bunch of my hand towels so I just grabbed two for now I will be getting more but I'm not sure what colors I all wanted so I had these two already so I they were $3 each, 100% cotton, and so far they're washing up really, really well. They're nice and absorbent, and they're really soft once they're washed. Uh, so I am, like I said, definitely going to be getting these again. So this is one of those items that I had re tested out, and it is a great product. And they're really nice and big for a hand towel, so I love them had to share <laughs> okay so this is another one of those items that it's food related uh, but I just wanted to share because 
My kids absolutely love these and so do I. I have only seen these at Dollarama and they're $1.25 each and they're for 10 but they taste like real fruit because they do use some natural fruit juice and, and natural flavors. So if you are in Canada and you see these and you want a more of a realistic freezy flavor, definitely try these out. Okay, so the item I was most excited about to see was this wood knife block to put in your drawer. This is all wood and it was only $4 and this is a solid heavy piece. I was super excited when I saw this so I'm definitely trying this out. If you guys see this and need a knife organizer for your drawer, get it. It's about, I believe it was six inches wide and I want to say about 16 inches long. I measured it for a friend. I think that's about the the dimensions. So uh, definitely a great deal. All right, everybody. I want to thank you all so much for being here again with me today. I hope you can find some of these items at your local Dollarama. It was a lot of fun to go in and find some of these items that I've been looking for for a while or just finding some new things. So uh, let me know what your favorite item was out of the lot and we will see you in the next video. Take care. Bye.